I'm going to go ahead and get started with the fun part, because in the words of the great Tim the Toolman Taylor, before there is construction, there is destruction. Okay, as you see under here, there is this big support beam, which is great. We know that we have support from this side to the other side. Um, maybe we can even, well, we can't really add any more because it all has to be on this slider. It has to be able to slide in. So you can see our rotten area here where it's pretty bad and it's literally just falling through. Um, so we're gonna take that out. I'm gonna try to take this whole piece out. Um, but we do have these, this big support beam over here, and then we have to make it all the way on the ledge. bottom layer of this we had to do in two pieces because you can't really find 12 foot pieces. There's no 12 by 4 so we did two 8 by 4s um, but we did two layers so the bottom way too bowy so we did a second on top and basically layered them on top, connected them. It's going to make it a little higher than most sliders but it's going to be fine I think. So we're going to cover this with flooring and trim it out and then fill it up. So yes we did two layers of flooring which does make it higher but this is so much sturdier. That's the whole camper rocking. But the floor is not bowing. It's not flexing at all on the bend, or it's not bowing like it was before. So it's really good. Also on that bottom layer, we did pressure treated wood, which is better for handling moisture. And we're also gonna come back and cover that on the bottom with a kind of water resistant seal. Putting vinyl flooring together is kind of a pain in the tush. It is really hard to get it tight if you're floating, but it's possible. So now we're going to cut pieces to go here and here, and then get some trim to go over top of this lip. So. So all in all, with everything we did, we took out the old floor, put in two new subfloors, and then put flooring over top of it, and then we added a trim at the very end to kind of just give it a better effect and close up that edge. It still slides in and out. We've talked about doing a temporary trim at the bottom to cover up that black and that plastic edge, but it really looks okay. We're gonna kind of see how it goes. All right, I'm gonna get started. Can you wait just a second? <laughs> 